Hello Commanders, and welcome to Beta 2.2, Beta 5, and I'm just doing a quick little scout around the new feature of module storage that we've all been waiting for. Now, um, I've had a little play with it already just to reduce the time of this video and keep it nice and simple. Um, I'm at Titan City, and uh, if we go into Starport Services, like so... Uh, you'll see now that if we go to outfitting uh, you'll see some slight changes uh, the main uh, one that you'll notice is the stored modules area now it's a bit buggy at the moment and I'll explain that in the moment so I may have to log in and out at points just to show you this feature but if I click on that you can see that I've already stored some um, modules. Now the first thing to point out is that you can store up to 30 modules at this moment in time. I'm sure there will be a lot of people asking for more storage at some point. But anyway, you've got 30 storage slots. So one module takes up one slot up to a maximum of currently 30. Now I've had a little play around and I've um, stored some modules on a planet not far from here um, and you can see that in order to get those back there's some basic shield boosters there if I select those it'll take five minutes for them to transfer to this station um, so that's pretty much the module storage uh, I can store more and this is where um, it gets a bit buggy at the moment when I'm in a station uh, if I click on the store multiple option this will give you all the hard points that you've got currently on your ship okay and you can store those you can drag that down and select as many as you want and store them and that all works fine and obviously you'll have a maximum as you can see below now I'm not going to store any more at the moment um, what I can do and it's let's store a couple of beam lasers there okay and that will strip them straight from the ship so let's do that now. So I've selected those two there, hit store, confirm that I want to store those and watch my power levels change as obviously I've got less power draw on the ship. And there we go. So those have now been removed from my ship. Now what you will find, I've got some shield boosters here that are down on the surface of the planet and what I can do is I can call those back because these two shield boosters as you can see are modified. Alright, and I can call them back without going to the planet. So if I choose transfer to the station, they're only around the corner, quite literally, 100 credits, and they're on their way. And I've got, I think I've got another modified one in here somewhere. And that one's in transit, okay, and that one there, and transfer to the station also. Again, it's in the same system, so <laughs> it's not going to take long, and the cost is minimal. So those now uh, two, of course, have gone grey and that uh, in transit. That's all working lovely and swish. Now, will it let me back out? It did. Excellent. And that's the bit that's a bit buggy. So I'll show you what I mean by buggy. If I choose this option here, maybe, and then back out of that, is it going to bug out? There we go. It's bugged out now. So I don't know why it does that. I mean, it's beta. You know, these things happen. But I'm, I am now stuck. I can't get out okay so um, well I'll just do what I can here and then I'll, I'll log in and back out so you can see I've got a load, of, a load of things that I've stored here now let's see if I can fit this chat chaff launcher mm. it seems to allow you to do a multi select as well okay and I guess you hit store multiple and it'll do that but uh, what I want to do now is fit these back to my ship and I don't seem to have that option now so I think we've, we've kind of bugged out a little bit let's see if I can get, oh I can't get to them because I need to get into outfitting right let's quickly log out and log back in again I'm stuck now so let's quickly go to the main menu and go back in we can expect these sorts of bugs early on of course so it's no drama really and the whole point of beta testing of course is to iron them out so let's quickly go back into open play and what I'll do now is I will go into the um, outfitting screen and see if I can fit any of these modules from storage 
as my anaconda spins round. So anyway, let me know what you think of the module storage. I think it's... I'm, I'm sure people are going to be asking for more storage. Um, currently 30 is the limit. I'm sure some balancing and so on and so forth will go on, but at the moment anyway, we have a limit of 30. So, uh, I've got some utility mounts now, have I got any space? I've got eight, uh, empty spaces now where I've been storing things. Okay, so let's see if I can get them back from storage. Transfer. There's my chaff launcher. Transfer to ship. Transfer. No, this is in the same station, so that's worked fine. Let's transfer again. What else have we got in here? So those are on the planet as well. As you see, there's a transfer time. And those ones are in transit, so I won't be able to transfer those just yet. Okay, and thankfully it's let me get back out. Okay, um, and also, uh, whilst we're here, uh, I don't want to do... Let's do a hard point. You can go to your hard points. Uh, let's see if I've got any... Yes, I've got some beam lasers in stock there in my module storage. I'll grab that from there. Transfer to ship. Lovely. And it has now appeared. Fantastic. So, yep, yeah, I'm liking the module storage. Like I say, it's a little bit buggy at the moment. Um, and those utility mounts uh, are still on their way. They'll be here in a minute. Um, so, yes, but you can also quickly point out that let's say this beam laser here if I go to transfer options I can store it's not immediately obvious but you can and it does work hit store I don't want to store it now well, I can do let's store it okay so I've stored that now and it'll go away and then what I'll do is I'll grab it back again just while my um, shield boosters arrive there we go stored right let's get that back then Transfer, and there's my beam laser. Transfer to ship. It's free, it's in the same place, and it is now fitted. So that is all looking nice, isn't it? There's my little beam laser, I'll put that back on as well. There you go. So that's module storage, really. Um, now, I've probably pad it padded out enough to get my modified shield boosters fitted. Oh, less than a minute, not quite. And of course if I wanted to bring these in then I could. I guess I'd have to sit and wait though. Um I can fit that one now. It needs to be modified. But um There we go, it's arrived. And now I can fit. Transfer the ship. There we go. And that one there as well. Transfer to ship. Okay. There we go. My modified shield boosters have now been put back. Oh no, I've got another one to modify that I haven't done yet. Okay, so there we go. A quick look at module storage. Let me know what you think. It's a little bit buggy still at the moment, but once you know what causes these problems, you can soon fix it. Okay, uh, uh, and that's it. So thanks for watching, and let me know what you think. And I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.